Hi, this is Sebastian from socialanxietysolutions.com. I am a former social anxiety disorder sufferer and I'm a social confidence coach. And since October 2009, I've been coaching socially anxious clients to go from social anxiety to social confidence. And um, I do that by combining traditional psychology with Eastern energy psychology. So traditional psychology is a lot about changing your thoughts, being mindful, and progressively facing your fears. And all of that is helpful, however, it's missing a key component, in my opinion, and that key component is addressing the emotional side of social anxiety. And a technique that I specialize in addresses that very effectively. And that technique is called EFT. It stands for Emotional Freedom Techniques. Uh, it's also known as tapping. And what is it? It's a psychological form of acupuncture, but instead of using needles, you tap with the tips of your fingers on specific acupressure points on the body. It looks really dumb. <laughs> it looks really silly because you're doing this. But um, it's actually scientifically proven to be effective. There are more than 100 peer-reviewed studies done on EFT that are published in peer-reviewed psychological and medical journals. Um, and uh, in this video, I actually interview a PhD researcher and uh, award-winning author who, whom I talk with about EFT. Now, what's so cool about EFT is when you do this weird tapping while you focus in on a particular problem, the emotions connected to the problem come up for you. And when you do the tapping, that releases them. It's amazing. All right, so I use this to overcome my own social anxiety and I've worked with hundreds of socially anxious clients um, and logged 5,000 coaching hours. And uh, this stuff really works, it's amazing. So uh, that doesn't mean that changing your thoughts is bad or not good enough, or, well, maybe it's not good enough actually, but uh, it, it means that we wanna have a combination of both. We wanna be able to um, change our thoughts. Changing your thoughts is helpful. Being mindful is helpful, but addressing the emotional side of your social anxiety, that's where you're gonna get the most results. That's where you're gonna really be able to free yourself and not make some improvement, but actually get to a place where you're free of your social anxiety. There is none, zero. And you can actually connect with people, have a good time, you know, not take things so seriously. Uh, say what's on your mind, make dumb mistakes and laugh at yourself, be at ease and in the moment. And from that place of being comfortable with yourself, accepting yourself, um, create great friendships, uh, have nourishing, nourishing relationships and all that good stuff. So they actually look forward to socializing. So you look forward to uh, the weekend and that kind of stuff. Anyway, since that's just me talking uh, and uh, the more important people you hear the same message from, the more you're willing to actually give things that are outside of your current um, this is acceptable and that is not acceptable realm, uh, the more likely you are, you are to actually try something like that. I'm talking about tapping. So here's my interview with PhD researcher Dawson Church. Just a snippet of it, just to get you excited. Here we go. Three, two, one. Dawson Church, PhD, is an award-winning author whose best-selling book, The Genie in Your Genes, has been hailed by reviewers as a breakthrough in our understanding of the link between emotions and genetics. He founded the National Institute of Integrative Healthcare, NIIH.org, to study and implement promising evidence-based psychological and medical techniques. He has published many scientific papers in peer-reviewed journals, collaborating with scholars at various universities on outcome studies of post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD, depression, and anxiety. His groundbreaking research has been published in prestigious scientific journals. He's the editor of Energy Psychology, Theory, Research, and Treatment, which is a peer-reviewed professional journal. He's a blogger for the Huffington Post, and he shares how to apply the breakthroughs of energy psychology to health and athletic performance through the EFT Universe website, which is one of the largest alternative medicine sites on the web. 
There is a lot of science behind EFT. There are over 100 scientific studies that have been published in peer-reviewed medical and psychology journals. So there's lots and lots of studies supporting EFT. But usually, Sebastian, the, the key piece of proof that you give people isn't the science. It's not facts. It's not argument. It's not persuasion. It's the experience you had inside your body. When mm. you feel, you describe that, all that tension is draining out of your body. And, and the truth is that actually you can process very little of your, your life effectively in your head. And techniques for change that rely on, on your mind making your body do things are a lot less successful than techniques that integrate both mind and body and emotions and spirituality all behind your goals. And so EFT does that. EFT releases all of those inner emotional, psychological, spiritual tensions, and then you just feel better, and then you can make progress toward whatever goal it is, is once you've let go of that energy structure that's been kept in place in your body for so long. What I, what I love about uh, EFT exactly is it is, it is um, an emotional or an energetic approach, and uh, you know there are other common approaches to overcoming social anxiety, which which focus on the, the cognitive and the behavioral. I'm like, yeah, but social anxiety is not a logical problem. I heard a funny quote recently. The quote was, if thinking could solve our problems, we would all be millionaires with six pack abs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> All right, hope you enjoyed that. Now, this is just a little blurb of the interview. The longer interview you can find on my channel as well or in my podcast, Social Anxiety Solutions in iTunes or on my website, Social Anxiety Solutions, where you can listen to or download all the episodes. I interview a whole bunch of psychologists, coaches, healers, psychotherapists for their best social anxiety solutions. It's a very inspiring podcast. People really love it. Now, um, we talk about EFT, which is one of the one of the most well-known techniques that I use and it is a very powerful technique but it is just a technique you can learn it in 10 minutes you know it's very very simple but it doesn't solve your social anxiety just knowing that technique just like having a hammer is helpful in order to build a house but you also need to have like a map of how to do it um, yeah, I've never built a house, so this analogy is not going anywhere, but <laughs> you need more, all right? So what you really need is you need to know how to use EFT specifically to overcome your social anxiety. And that's what I've dedicated my life to pretty much in the past 10 years. And, um, you know, I've, I've got a very good mind map as to how to do that. Now, I offer that for free. It's called my Social Confidence Starter Kit, and you can get that on my website. And um, when you get that on my site, what do you get? Well, you get 10 free videos. They're all like five or 10 minutes each, where I teach you the basics of this technique, and I teach you how to apply it to overcome your social anxiety, and also guide you through an experience of it, so that you actually feel the emotions shifting your body. Pretty amazing. Uh, and I uh, give you as well my ebook where I um, break down how you can go from social anxiety to social anxiety free. Now you can get all of that by clicking under the link under this video or by going to socialanxietysolutions.com. Hope it's been helpful. Share this video with anyone who might benefit from it, and I'll talk to you soon.